Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Cold Old Melbourne. This is AADA TV 2011. Uh, in the Trade Village this year, there are 26 exhibitors who are showcasing their products and services. Now, our former Prime Minister Paul Keating once famously said, in the race of life, always back self-interest. At least you know it's trying. And he's right. Now, these exhibitors have spent a lot of time, effort and money. They've travelled into state in a lot of circumstances to exhibit this week. So take it upon yourselves to visit their exhibits to support those who are supporting our industry. Let's see what some of them have got to say. Rose Kutsudontis, Herald Sun Cars Guide. Welcome to AADA. Thank you, Cam. Very happy to be here. This interview is going to be a little bit different. We're going to have a 60 second fast questions. Are you ready? Ready. How many people read the Cars Guide every Friday? Over 732,000. How many people are over 18? All of those people actually. What's the average time spent reading the Cars Guide? Over 11 minutes. What percentage of readers who read the Cars Guide are going to buy a car in the next six months? 77% of those readers looking to buy a car. Is it right? What's the average circulation of the Herald Sun on a daily basis? Over 500,000 actually. Is it higher on weekends? Absolutely. What's the readership per day of the Herald Sun? On average about 1.4 million people. How many on average pages are in the Cars Guide on Friday? Anything from sort of 48 to 56 pages depending on the week. It was a slow week last week, wasn't it, Rose? No, 52 pages was a good week. Oh, okay. exceptional. Now, across seven days, the total reach, Herald Sun, across uh, both print and online, how many, view how many viewers and readers does it reach? Sure, that number is actually 2.478 million. I'm impressed. And lastly, the Herald Sun is a news, corporate, is a news corporation publication, of course. Yes. Have any dealer principals' mobile phones ever been hacked by any members of your organisation? Absolutely not. Did you ever listen to Pink Floyd? Uh, a long time ago, yeah. I'm showing my age, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> you are. The drummer from Pink Floyd, Nick Mason, he went out and spent $10 million on cars. Right. When he was asked about it afterwards, he said if he could get back every cent he spent on cars, yes. he'd spend it again on cars. Fantastic. When your dealers are coming to see Pentana Solutions and they're spending money or investing money, we should say, in Pentana Solutions with these new products, yes. what can they expect? Look, there's a number of benefits from Deal the Socket and an integrated CRM solution. Uh, the first one is increased sales across the showroom and also service. We also see a reduced cost in marketing spend um, by up to 40%. Um, and one of the very core things about Deal the Socket integrated to our DMS is improved CSI scores. Um, it gives the customer, the dealer, the retail dealer the ability to have one view of their customer. So what's their spend across service, what's their spend across parts and showroom, all on one consolidated view and obviously that helps with marketing activities and initiatives. So it's a very powerful tool. Well that was a lot of information to get into one big sentence. So if you want that explained a little more clearly, you'd better come and see the boys at Pentana Solutions. Richard, there's a big crew here as well. See you soon. And I'm at the CRMA stand with Jason Fisher. Jason, welcome to AADA. Thanks very much for having us, Cam. Now, Jason, as I understand, with CRM companies, it's notoriously competitive. It is a very competitive industry, yeah. It is indeed. Now, what sets CRMA apart from your competitors? Oh, we're, we're in a pretty unique situation. We can handle a client who might only have 30 letters to send out, or uh, we've actually just done a job for a client recently who did 135,000 letters. So we can handle clients from any size, um, any requirements, whether it be letters or emails or text message or anything like that. And at the end of the day, I own the business and you have my mobile number and you can call me anytime if, if there's anything you need to discuss. I'm with Scott Woolley at Suncorp Five Star. How are you, Scott? Good, thanks, Ken. What can you tell us, for for the people who don't know, what can you tell us about Suncorp Five Star? Suncorp Five Star is an association that's been in existence for over 15 years throughout Australia. We provide tailor-made insurance solutions for the motor dealership industry. Uh, insurance solutions for the retail paper, CTP, and also for the assets, exposures and liabilities associated with owning and running a motor dealership. Very good. And if dealers want to obtain a quote from Suncorp Five Star, how do they go about that? Look, we provide a very simple process, either whilst the conference is on, come up and see us, we can have a chat to you, or talk to your insurance broker. Now Scott and the boys have made their way down from Queensland, is that right? Correct, yes we have. While you're here in Melbourne, would you like to hear a Victorian winter joke? Hit me with it, Cam. How many Mount Buller ski instructors does it take to screw in a light globe? How many? None. They all screw in the jacuzzi. <laughs> <laughs>